Hi everyone, welcome to Fast Homebrew and we are making a toucan stout, which is good because it's a pun, because it's made from toucans, a Cooper's Dark Owl and a Cooper's Stout, and we just push them, put them together, not quite like that. Okay, let's get into it, getting the stuff out, those are the yeasts. We need to put it in the sink in hot water for a while to soften it up so that we can pour it out the can. So in they go, fill up the sink, and all done. Okay, yes, that's nice and hot, good, all right. Now we get our fermenter so that we can sanitize it. There it is, put the fermenter down, get some water, and star sand I'll be using. You don't need very much of it. If I was better at aiming the camera, you'd be able to see that. But in she goes, and give it a, oh wait, first check to make sure the tap, yep, that's all good. Give it a shake, give it a shake, and I'll be doing that for a while, so we'll skip forward a bit. And, okay, here I am using the sanitizer now to clean some other things, like the tap and that thing. And my big spoon, in it all goes. This is all while we wait for the hot water to do its job on the cans. And now it's done. So I'll get my can opener. There it is. And get stuck into these guys. Round we go. This stuff is very thick. So hopefully now we should be able to pour it nicely into the fermenter. Yep, that's much easier than it would have otherwise been. I'm sure of it. Good. Oh, and you can see that there's a fair bit left over in there. So the way we get rid of the fair bit left over in there is that we fill them with hot water again. Boiling water. And they get very, very hot. So give them a bit of a stir. Put the lids back on. And... There we go. Time passes. Now they're nice and... Uh, watery and all of the good gooiness has run down in there but we can't pick it up because it's too hot so get a tea towel pour it in one two you can might be able to see that it's much cleaner on the inside now it was black before almost in they go and oh yes it makes the label sticky the last step now is just to fill it with water this is such a simple recipe I'm using uh, spring water because the local water's got a lot of stuff in it which is not good for your beer so fill it with water in she goes give it a stir I'll be stirring this for a while too so we'll skip forward a little bit any time now there we go time passes now I'm taking a sample to measure it this taps difficult to use this is actually me making a mess all right sample into the uh, hydrometer which measures basically the thickness of whatever you're trying to measure and oh what I'm doing there is getting rid of the bubble so that you don't get a, a false reading alright final step now time for the yeast in goes the yeast and we use both packets in this one one two everyone's happy lid goes on I suppose there it is and we're done good well that was that one can of Cooper's stout one can of Cooper's dark ale 23 litres all good